Cam Course at the net. And the Trojans have an edge, I would say, in power. The senior, co-captain. Yeah, nice one-two punch there. Cayetano delivering a strong serve. Yeah, nice interception by Course. So country in singles. That's nice playing. Good defending from Cayetano and Kulikov. Just finding a way to keep this point going to put Spence in a difficult position. With the air on the volley. And that was a big point, wasn't it? Love 15, could have been love 30. Remember, no ad scoring. There's not, not a little deuce ad going on. You've got to deliver. Those early points in a game can be huge. When we talk about USC, the pedigree, and that is something that Course and Spence right now are trying to maybe take advantage of. Trying to get an opportunity here. Ooh, they're working over the line pretty good. Course comes up with a clean strike. Of coming up. Oh, that is a brilliant point from both sides. And the Trojans ultimately prevail with a great effort by Chorus to track down this ball wide. And this is how it finished off. Nice volley. A wonderful game for the Trojans who get the break back. And the unranked Notre Dame Fighting Irish. The Fighting Irish, although with six dual match wins already. And this is court three, number three doubles. Yeah, that's not the player you want to love. Waldron has a strong serve. Equally strong overhead smash. Did a good job of staying on balance as well, of stopping and gathering herself. That's a very athletic move up at the net. Now more power tennis. Yeah, there it is. There's the break. Okay. Set points on court three. And Notre Dame playing some nice doubles and a good finish there from Lillian and Waldrum taking it 6-2. Set and match point here. Save that one. Wilson can be a big hitter, particularly off the return. Let's see what she does with this chance. Yeah, good return. So USC takes the doubles at number two. That's 6 2. Look so easy. out. Wonderful exchange. All four players up at the net. Great to see that in women's doubles. So here is a deciding point, set point, and a point for the doubles on the line. 
No, the double fault and the Trojans who were down a break early rebound pretty nicely to take the set. 6-2, so the Trojans get the doubles point and that's an important step for them. Nice move from Kulikov at extra margin. Yeah, that's a nice ball there. She tested that backhand down the line and Spence couldn't deliver. So Kulikov gets through a close game. Underlines the break. So the Trojans at number one, looking to be in good shape out of the blocks. For the Trojans here on court two, Aaron Cayetano taking on Cam Course of the Irish. Cayetano, the French, the freshman from Long Beach, California. Cam Course, the junior from Baltimore, Maryland. Yeah, she does get the game. Not that far. It's a wonderful forehand. You can see what a potent weapon it is for her, the junior. Oh. 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 comes up with the pass. But Alfin. Keeps the break advantage at 3-1. She's been able to extend some of these rallies and it's put her in pretty good position here on serve. This is a look at what's going on on the other courts. Of course, USC won the doubles point to start the day. Yeah, Notre Dame is up at number three and at number six. Remember, they need to find three or four, I should say, matches. So it's going to be a tough road for them. It's going to be someone coming from behind if they're going to pull off the win over USC today as the Trojans are in a good place. Can they maintain it? able to get it done and fitness is one of her strong suits she works very hard yes, he does. Oh, wonderful pass nice exchange Spence get the, gets the best of that one. Go. 
Yeah, some nice work in defense. Spence gets the break. Can't make it happen that time. So Kulikov takes the opening set at number one singles, and she can smile through that. There are some tough moments coming down the stretch, but she gets it done. The drop shot lob works beautifully. Deciding point, game point for Notre Dame. Set point still for USC. No, it's over the baseline. Unforced error. Cayetano takes the set. 6-4. So the Trojans making some moves. They've got the opening set at one and two. She has, and obviously delivering a much needed win. Again, the heart of the lineup is something that Allison Silverio has talked about. Be really strong, Notre Dame. Notre Dame. Really solid win for Kochowski, who dictated from start to finish in this match, had a clear game plan and gives her team a much needed win, much needed point. after hitting the winning volley. Yeah, that's a nice win for Paige Freeman. So a couple of quick points for Notre Dame. 6-3, 6-3 at number three. And Notre Dame has a 2-1 lead. Backhand. Yeah. A couple of good winners. First off the backhand, there's the forehand. Closes it out. Straight sets over Cam Course. So here's Kulikov at number one, couple points away from getting to 3 2. Now she covered the cross court. to win it. Pretty stylish finish for Kulikov. Yeah, Boychuk out of Franklin, Tennessee, junior. Yeah, the serve and volley gets it done. It's a brave tennis from Boychuk who will force a third set against Van Alphen. So a couple of three setters to decide this one tonight in Lake Nona. And Lily missed it, so Jagger gets on the board. That's a big moment.
Now there is the break. So we are back on serve, and what a huge change that might be and how this match will play out as Jager gets to two, three. Cross court off the two hander. So this would move the match to three points all if Boychek can close it out. That's why they call him the Fighting Irish. Boychek fighting her way to victory from a set down. Incredible. Yeah, that one didn't come up. Instead, Estella Jager comes up with another break. Don't go anywhere, plenty more to come. She's got the inside out. <laughs> now we know she's got the inside in as well. A little more selective about when she plays that one. Yeah, this is just a big time forehand. No hesitation. And couldn't have hit it much better. Yeah. Well, there it is. That's five games all. What a Big forehands up the line, inside in at some crucial times. 
Looked like she might go inside out and just switched it up at the last moment. Getting that into play, so six games all. A tie break to decide this one. Who will walk away with the victory tonight on College Match Day? Side out forehand. two service points. Yeah. Well, the lob is effective. Buys Jager time and position. Yeah. Yeah. There's a little space down there, but she found the top of the net. So more match points for Notre Dame. Check winning at number four from a set down. And here's Ju Julia Lillian winning in three sets. A tiebreaker in the final set. And she was down to set two. She could barely believe it. That's a moment of euphoria for everyone on the team. So the Fighting Irish take down the Trojans four through. We'll come back to Orlando and wrap things up. <laughs> 